We're at a dog park here in Brooklyn Heights at a corgi meetup, and we're gonna see if the Google Lens can correctly identify all the corgis here. Once a month, we organize corgi meetups for the corgi community to come out with their corgis, to gallivant, hang out with other corgi enthusiasts. Corgis come in different color patterns. You know, there's the most traditional corgi that the Queen will have owned, which are the Pembroke Walsh Corgi, generally blonde. There's the Cardigan Corgi, which is a corgi as well, but not of the Pembroke breed. They're slightly bigger, uh, they have tails. <laughs> so hard. Google Lens got Pembroke Welsh Corgi. Pembroke Welsh Corgi. The Scotch Collie? That one's not right at all, no. That low profile butt angle gun. It's a happy corgi. It's definitely not a vicinity, it's a, it's a Superman corgi. So 100% wrong. Come on, Google. That one's correct, yeah. Definite fail. I think it's a corgi. Says, hmm, not seeing this clearly yet. I guess can't be drinking water then. Pembroke Welsh Corgi. You got a dog butt? You want to try the dog butt? Dog butt works. Says, hmm, not seeing this clearly yet. So that one didn't work. Got a Pembroke Welsh Corgi. This is definitely a cardigan. Got a Karelian Bear Dog or an Australian Collie. So they're both very incorrect. All right. There you go. Cardigan Walsh or a Pembroke Walsh? She's a cardigan. Yeah. She's a cardigan. Cardigan for sure. Good job, Google. Got an old English bulldog, a Akita. No corgi in sight. No. Let's see if that worked. <laughs> Pembroke Walsh Corgi. Pembroke Welsh again. Pembroke Welsh Corgi. That's a, it's a Norwegian loon hound. It's a good old small Pembroke Welsh Corgi. There you go. Dorgi? What's a Dorgi? That's a dorky. So that's a wrap. Google Lens only got 11 out of the 20 corgis right. That's about 50%, and that's much worse than we expected, considering we're at a corgi meetup. Hopefully in the future, the AI will be able to correctly identify every dog, but as of now, it needs a lot of work. Either way, it's a pretty cool feature, and you can check it out on Google Photos on iOS and Android.